This is Jose from Southern Life. And on this video, we're gonna be checking out the new Publix in Montgomery, Alabama. We are way on the east side. This is kind of like the suburbs. Let me make sure I lock my car. Yo, this is the suburbs kind of way to the east. Um, they just opened up a Publix here by Pike Road. So I guess this will be the Pike Road Publix. Um, there's already like five Starbucks in this area, so I don't think they're gonna get a Starbucks here. But uh, definitely a new Publix. So let's go inside and see what we can do. Now, I'm from Elmore County, so I don't know if I'm supposed to wear anything on my face. You know how these rich city people are. Check it out, Pike Road. And Katie's gonna be doing some grocery shopping here. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do. But this is the new, how you doing, sir? This is the new Pike Road Publix. Similar to many other Publixes you've been to, the inside the roof is, oh, this is nice. Let's see here. All right, guys, so let's explore this new Publix. Definitely the nicest Publix I've ever seen. This is balling. I mean, I've been to a lot of Publixes before, but this is just over the top balling. I mean, it's just, uh, wow, what an incredible Publix. You guys know I'm a sucker for Publix. This is just incredible. They got their meat on the side, that's kind of odd. Let's see what they got here. They got asparagus. Just about everything you would need is right here. Oh, the meats. Let's see here. Let's see. Here. Ooh, flank steaks. Ribeyes. Just everything you'd want right here. Definitely the most balling Publix I've ever seen. Not cool with that background music, though. I can get us a copyright strike. Hopefully it won't. This is definitely the most balling Publix I've ever seen. Sweet deal. What you got? So what you gonna make? I'm gonna make carne con papa. All right. I'm gonna grab some avocados. Are we low on avocados? Yes, we do need avocados. Cool, they got some over here. Where are they from? Tommy's garbage. Want to get some bananas? They're kind of green. We have to get the meat. Grapes are always good, right? They're not cheap. Four dollars a pound. They're never cheap. Mm -hmm. Not enough. How much is that? A pound and a quarter? Yeah. Wanna make extra just in case we can have for later? No, yeah, we always make extra. Yeah. I'm tempted to get a sub. Wanna grab some shrimp or no? How you doing? Good, I'm just looking. Uh, give me one second. I'll have um, a sandwich. 
Uh, on white bread, roast beef. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Swiss. Yes, ma'am. Lettuce, tomato, mayonnaise, that's it. All right, thank you, ma'am. Um, not well, yeah, but not before you put it in the oven, all right? Yeah. All right, thank you. I guess I'll get a sandwich for now, and then you can do that tomorrow or tonight, whenever. Yeah, I'll get it. I'm good, thank you. Lettuce, tomato, mayonnaise. All right, thank you so much. Thank you. Seven dollars to get one of the most incredible sandwiches ever. What you getting, soup? Yeah, the white cheddar and broccoli. Cool. Grab some waters. Ten dollars. Wow. Core and smart water. Let's go wait, we're gonna spend like $300 here. Mm -hmm. I found some stuff I haven't been able to find out from Walmart. A little bit a little bit. Got a debit card? Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Appreciate it. If it's a young person, do you still say thank you, ma'am? I don't get how this whole sort of thing works. I'm trying, dang it, I'm trying. Back in Florida, you just flicked the person off and that was it. Now you have to say yes, sir, yes, ma'am. But if it's a young person, do you still say thank you, ma'am? Uh, I just watched do you the say, on this. Do you, how, what are you supposed to say? What if it's a young person? In the South. Yeah. I, I feel prematurely aged, but that's a general consensus. You don't say that to, you can't say ma'am to young people? You can, you're supposed to. To young people too? Yep. Okay, because I thought you were not supposed not to say it to young people. too young. So how, how do you know when somebody's too young to call them a ma'am? If they're 
five years old, obviously new. You don't? Now you're supposed to put your cart back when you go to a shopping center. Um, you're supposed to put the shopping cart back in these things. Now, back again, back to Florida. In Florida, we just threw it in the parking lot and watched it hit somebody's car. Uh, but here in Alabama, the right thing to do is to put it back in a designated shopping cart parking spot. So there it is, a tour of a brand new Publix in Pike Road, which is a suburb of Montgomery, Alabama. 